Assalamualaikum and very good day. My name is Muhammad Faris Fidaus bin Halidi and I will be presenting an innovation idea that pop up in this pandemic days. It was invented by an Indian eco-technologist and interestingly, his idea is eco-friendly. Nowadays, face mask is considered as essential thing when we go outdoors. Based on a survey made in Singapore, 15 million ways are generated per week when every people wears averagely 5 masks in that period. For bigger country like Malaysia, waste management experts estimate that at least 10 million single-use face masks are discarded daily in the country. For your information, a three-layer face mask for COVID-19 prevention is made of cotton for inner layer, plastic like polypropylene for middle layer, and non-woven adsorbent plastic such as polyester for the outer layer. A vast amount of plastic particles waste in the environment may end up in the streets and landfills, or at every worst case, it reaches the fresh and marine water. The idea came up after observing there is none appropriate recycle method of the waste. Thus, the upcycling of face masks to brick is innovated. The successful transformation ratio of face masks to brick incorporates three main substances which are 45% paper waste provided from paper mills, 3% binder which functions as adhesive and lastly the face mask itself is majority with 52%. The process starts with sanitation process which the face masks are left untouched for 72 hours and after that put into disinfection for 3 to 4 hours. After that the masks are collected, shredded and added to paper waste before mixes it with special binder which if you want to do it at your home we are suggesting you to use glue light solution. The mixture is then kept for 5 to 6 hours before being set in molds. Lastly, the bricks are naturally dried for 3 days and there it goes. The product is then ready for use. The advantages of this innovation is obviously it can reduce the environmental pollution. Finally, there is a proper recycling management of face masks waste in the pandemic era. Furthermore, less mining activities of minerals such as clay and sand would happen. Some conventional bricks in the market like red brick and AAC brick use clay or mixture of cement, sand, lime and editing agent. This can happen by substituting the minerals with plastic materials made up in the mask. Next, the brick mat after face masks are durable, easy to make and much more affordable than others. The process carried out in a homely surrounding is a proof that the manufacturing process can be done without much complex tax and experts. The innovator also claimed that the brick mat after face mask is three times stronger than the conventional red brick. As a conclusion, upcycling this face mask waste and producing construction materials such as the lightweight brick seems to be a viable solution in the near future to reduce the plastic waste, thus lessen the environmental issue and also improve health impact. Thank you very much.